Are you sure it's your scope that's bad? What if it's your leads that are just lying to you? Let me show you a quick 10 second test to verify if your scope test leads are 100%. Okay, let's check a look. With my meter set to series, I'm gonna put my red test lead right here in the center of the BNC connector. Then I'm gonna take my other lead to the color side or the positive side of the actual scope lead. Notice how we have continuity, so that means that is okay. Now I'm gonna test the ground side, still going to the center pin of the BNC. Would you look at that? I'm still on the center pin and I'm on the ground lead of my scope and I still have continuity. What you saw right there was the scope lead is actually shorted internally. This means this scope lead is no good. If we were to try to use it to capture a scope capture, we might see a flat line or we might see a straight bolted. Now, let me show you guys a good one so this way you can see the difference. Take a look. So on my good lead, I went to the center pin of the BNC and to my positive side of the lead and I have continuity. Now let me go to the ground side of the lead and see if we have continuity. So notice how still on the center pin of the BNC and to the ground side, I have infinite resistance. This indicates that these two circuits are not interconnected, so they're still actually separate. Now let me test the other side of the BNC to see if we're any good. So when I say the other side of the BNC, instead of testing the center pin, I slide it in right here on the side, I set that down, and then I test it on the ground side of my actual scope lead. So right there we have continuity, so that means that side is okay. Now let's verify it by going to the positive side of the actual lead once again, just to verify it, I have infinite resistance. So this means this lead is 100% okay. So before you condemn your scope, always run this test on your leads just to make sure you don't spend a couple hundred to a thousand bucks or more on a new scope when all you need is new scope lead. For us, the scope leads I just tested are about three years old. So I got about three years out of them, which is not bad. Always make sure if you start seeing some weird stuff on your scope leads, run this quick check. This way you can make sure you see if your scope leads need to be replaced. I know this information was useful. Make sure you guys give us a like and a follow. Share this video so this way other techs who might be struggling with their scope leads won't know how to test them. See you guys on the next one.